to load. Uh, and it's Richard Hoyles uh, for the commentary for all the races this evening. Thank you, Leona. All set for the first. So, a mile and a half. Tortured Soul was just a little bit up in the air and jumped slightly awkwardly, but didn't lose any ground in the early paces. Just modest through the first furlong of this Boost Your Acker with Bent UK Apprentice Handicap. No one that keen to really go on. Lexington Hero racing on the outside of Oyamal as they've taken their time through the first furlong. Grigio races in third place. Yellow Jacket, and that is the Grey Horse, just ahead of Win Win Power. Van Dabby Dozy races in fifth. Tortured Soul under restraint by Ethan Jones, taking quite a keen hold. The return to the flat for, for pleasure sees him settled at the back in the pink jacket and military decoration is last of all as at a slightly better pace Oyamal just begins to stride on. So it's Oyamal who has the lead by a length from Lexington Hero in second place and Grigio sits in third. Win Win Power is in fourth place as they make the turn into the back straight and towards the final mile. Van Dabby Dozy on the inside of Tortured Soul then for pleasure and military decoration as Oyamal has completed the turn into the back straight and they now have a mile to travel. Oyamal leading by a length from Lexington Hero. Win-win power moving up on the outside of Grigio. They are third and fourth with Tortured Soul. A neck in advance and still racing keenly of Van Dabby Dozy. Military decoration and for pleasure is right at the back of the field who are still covered by only about five or six lengths. Are still sitting pretty out in front, Oyamal. Hasn't broken any records to this point. In second place is Lexington Hero. Third on the inside remains Grigio of Win Win Power. Tortured Soul on the outside of Van Dabby Dozy. Uh, then just pushed along for pleasure. Pink Jacket at the back with military decoration last of all as Oyamal leads the turn out of the back straight, entering the final five furlongs. Lexington Hero in second. Win Win Power Grigio, Tortured Soul in the yellow colours in fifth place on the outside of Van Dabby Dozy. Then military decoration and for pleasure as they reach the crown of the bend. Entering the final half mile, Oyamal has dictated to this point, still travels well. By a length from Lexington Hero, win-win power towards the centre of the race course. Tortured Soul in the yellow jacket, on the rails the great Grigio. Van Dabby Dozy for pleasure and military decoration as Oyamal now begins to try and stretch them as they enter the final three. Oyamal from Lexington Hero, win-win power towards the outside with two furlongs to go. Then on the extreme left is Tortured Soul trying to get involved as the dash has begun for home. Still Oyamal in the centre has the lead. Win-win power, Tortured Soul under pressure. Lexington Hero, Grigio military decoration down the centre. Oyamal stacked them up and has now tried to sprint for home. Win-win power and military decoration are the two closest. Oyamal still narrowly. Win-win power coming with a run. Then military decoration on the inside. A three-way bob. Could go anyway. Military decoration on the inner possibly. But it's close with win-win power and Oyamal. And a three-way photo in the dash for the line. Lexington Hero was next across the line and Tortured Soul was only fifth, very close. It really was very close, but I think Richard, yeah, I think the far.